is it even worth it to even get married now, married nowadays as women in today's world? So I think it's a good choice for who it's good for. I think um, because we've evolved so much as women and we have rights that we haven't had before and choices that we we haven't had before, you know, it's an option. It's not an option for everyone. It's not an option that everyone wants. Um, I think the best thing about marriage is that you can decide if and when you want to. Um, I know people in the manosphere don't believe that, but like if you didn't want to be married and you decide that you want to, you can. I mean, you know, it's totally worth it for, you know, whoever uh, subscribes to it, but you can absolutely have a very loving and fulfilling relationship without marriage, or you can have a very loving and fulfilling life by yourself. You know, we, we have choices in the balls in our court. Mm, okay. Okay. Um, when you say the balls in our court, what do you mean by that? Because women have more rights now or because women are less dependent on men financially? What do you mean? Okay. Um, but I also mean that like we can choose to partner or we can choose not to. And if we choose not to partner, it doesn't mean the end of our lives is not going to be a detriment to us. Now, keep in mind, you know, I'm very much pro marriage. I, I, I think it's a great idea. It's wonderful. If those are ideals that you hold, if you don't hold those ideals, then it's not going to be as special or impactful to you. So I think just kind of pushing the idea that it's good for everyone is harmful. This is Conversation with King. Please don't forget to hit the subscribe button. And until next time, it's all love until you start something.